Hey, today I'm going to be doing another video review, but not on a Transformer. Today we're going to be taking a look at something else, and that being the Marvel Legends Hobgoblin Wave Pizza Spider-Man. So here's Pizza Spider-Man, and he's pretty nice. This is a pretty good figure. It's my favorite Spider-Man action figure that I have. He does come with quite a bit of accessories, so... We'll take a look at that right now. So the accessories that he comes with are one, two, eight, three sets of interchangeable hands of pizza and two heads. First set of hands are these wall crawling slash pizza holding hands, which look pretty nice. You also just come with some fisted hands and these wall crawling hands. And he also does come with this piece of pizza, which, hold on. It's pretty nicely sculpted, nice red on him. It does have some yellow missing, and then some red missing, but it's okay. His first head sculpt is the normal Spider-Man head sculpt, which I really like. It looks pretty nice, and uh, do have some red missing right there on the chest. I'll get into more details later on. It does have a whole lot. You can't put a toy with a stand in there. It looks, it's a pretty nice head. It does also have this half unmasked head which yeah got on there and again looks pretty nice it's meant for holding the pizza and you put in the pizza hand like like this hold on I think so let me see if I can do this off camera there we go I got him holding the pizza so he holds it pretty nicely and, uh, there's nice cobwebbing throughout him that's only painted on there. It's not sculpted. It looks pretty good throughout him. And as you can see, he does have that red missing right there. But it's not a big deal. It looks pretty nice throughout him. He does have those numbers right there. But I do think this is a pretty good figure. His articulation on him is pretty good. For example, be it. Both heads look up, look down, do a 360, and some neck pivot does have armpit joints right there. Arms move outward, inward, also do a 360, bicep swivel, double jointed elbows, all the wrists move side to side, hinge up and down, ab crunch joint, weights can also do a 360. Hips can only move out that much, which is kind of a shame. And they kick forward that much. Can move back some. Upper thigh swivel. Double jointed knees. And ankles move down, up, and he does have ankle pivot. And for a comparison, there he is with... The Marvel Legends Blizzard figure from the Hulkbuster wave that uses the Bucky Cap mold just to give you an idea of how big he's supposed to be. There's my review for today. Bye.